Hello, you lovely people. Hello. Welcome back to my channel, and I'm joined by the Ulster. The old stuff. Oh, you call me Oliver. Oh, Ulster Oliver. But anyway, guys, yeah, why is he joining me for this? Well, it's another sea monkey video, isn't it, Ollie? Yes. So we've got to we the point. We haven't seen one in a while. Yeah, we haven't done one in a while. And the reason why we're jumping back on for another little refresh, another look. Is because we now have hundreds uh, of sea monkeys, don't we? Yes. We literally have hundreds of them now, guys, and you can see them even better. So what we're going to do is we're going to show you them for a little while, playing around in their little tank, and then I'm going to teach Oliver something I have to do twice a day, every single day, for a minute each time, which is to aerate the water. You will also see the food in the bottom, and we'll blow that up and mix it around the tank a bit so that they can uh, eat because they do i mean it's brilliant because you see them all gathering down the bottom eating don't you ollie yes so yeah the next scene will be all the sea monkeys playing around in the tank won't it ollie yeah and then yeah like i said guys we'll teach ollie what to do with aerating the water because we don't want it going stagnant and killing them all do yeah. we no especially when we've got hundreds of them so yes guys, please join us as we take another look at the fantastic sea monkeys that Harold von Braunhut brought to the world back in 1957. Are right, you ready for this? a long time ago for I me. Know. It was, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a long time ago. Imagine how many sea monkey kits have been sold in all that time. Thousands. Billions of them. Thousands. Mm. Right, okay then guys, the next scene will be the sea monkeys, he says, trying to reach over Oliver to get to the button. Right, here we go, guys, with a quick update on the old sea monkeys, eh, Oliver? Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to show you what we have to do every single day, twice a day. We'll show you that in a minute, but obviously here are the sea monkeys. You probably can't see very much at the moment, but I'm telling you now, guys, there is literally, how many, Ollie? Hundreds, isn't there? Thousands. Thousands, Oliver thinks. Oh, you can see a few of them floating around already. But yeah, in a minute, we're going to focus in and watch them for a little while. And then I'm going to teach Oliver how to do the airing. Twice a day we've got to do that to keep them alive. Right. First they're going to die. Oh, oh yeah, all oh, they'll die otherwise. Yeah, right. So back in a sec when I've focused it right in for you guys. Bye. Right now. Right guys, here we go, we've focused right in. Now obviously you can see loads of them down the bottom there yeah. already. Just tons of them, but here we go, we're going to put a torch behind guys. A little trick. A little trick, oh, getting them all going, yeah, there we go. Mm. I'll let you watch them for a little bit there. Let's focus in more on one of the, uh... oh no, oh look at the bottom guys, look at the bottom, there's a whole swarm of them down there. What we'll do is we'll focus in on one of the magnifiers a bit more. It looks more better on the camera. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, and when you put the uh, the torch behind it, you know, they all tend to go towards the light. Yeah. They're, they like that's the what, light. That's what you showed me. Yeah. All right, okay, let's pull it in a bit more to the... Yeah. Oh, there you go, guys. You can see there. They do play with each other. They chase each other around. We've been watching them do that, haven't we, Ollie? Yeah. And Josh was stood fascinated with it last night for ages, watching them. There you go. If you look into the magnifier, the round bit on the left bottom, guys, you can see them a lot better there. Yeah, they are. Oh, they're just, they're just incredible. There's literally hundreds of these in the uh, yeah in this tiny tank, guys. Makes you wonder because they're going to grow. Tiny yeah, I mean, they're going to grow twice this size, guys. It makes you wonder if we're going to need to get a bigger tank of all of them, you know. They're kind of survive. like ants. 
Because like only pla- only one that it's useless, but with a bunch they're actually good. Yeah, they like playing with each other, don't they? Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to be ordering the diamonds soon because I think they're getting to the size now where we could do Yay. that. And we'll put the diamonds in for them to play with. That'll mm. be cool. Oh, I, I can really see a few see massive ones shooting by there. Right, let's yeah. focus it back down again. Let's have a look, guys. Try and get it back down so you can look at the bottom a bit more. Right, let's take it down a bit, guys, so you can see the bottom. There we go. You can see the swarm around there. And they're already having babies, so they've been mating already. And, uh, yeah, that's very interesting because there's just going to be more and more and more coming. You can see they're, they're eating at the bottom there. All that green stuff at the bottom is algae. That's what they live off. That's what they eat. They do not have mouths, though, guys. They don't have mouths. They're, uh, they actually take it in through their, uh, through their um, well, like little little uh, wings almost. Like little, yeah, that's, that's how they eat, guys. They take it through their... Little basically, tongues? There's like gills there, and they, they take the food through there. They don't actually have mouths. That's weird. Yeah. Now, I heard a lady talking on a video the other day about how she wants to put them in her into her fish uh, <laughs> tank and uh, the guy from the sea monkeys website said yeah go ahead it'll uh, give the fish a nice treat to eat and she was quite shocked and he said yeah they're brine shrimp and uh, tropical fish they they eat them and in fact most pet shops sell brine shrimp to feed to your fish so yeah she didn't want to do that <laughs> she decided not to put them in her fish tank but yeah, there you can see, guys, they're absolutely brilliant, aren't they, Ollie? Brilliant. Yeah, right, let's zoom in ants. down here a bit more so you can see this little swarm going on. You should there. call them sea ants. Yeah, you should call them something. Can you see them all down there, guys? Look, yeah. eating the plankton. Right at the bottom there, Ollie. Can you see all that green? Yeah. And they're eating it, aren't they? That so many. Swarms of meat in it, yeah. I can't even count to that much. That is absolutely fascinating. So yeah, guys, right back in a sec, and we'll uh, show you how we uh, put some air into the tank to keep them alive. Right, here we go, guys. So we're going to do the old uh, aerating. So yeah, we've got the old uh, little pump thing here. There we go. So what you have to do, guys, I'll do it first, and then we'll get Oliver doing it. So right, Oliver, we've got to take the lid off. So here we go. That's it. Put the lid down there. And then, guys, you make sure that you've got it nice and full of air. And you put it in. Oh, yeah, I do see some plankton in You put it in like this. And there we go. And then you can blow it into the, into the old uh, algae. There we go. But make sure that when you take it back out, guys, that you keep your fingers on that bit. Keep it down, otherwise you'll suck the sea monkeys up. Then fill it back up again. Back in again. Yeah, yeah, you don't go. get to do it anymore. Yeah, you do. You're going to do it in a minute. Oh, oh. Yeah. Right, okay. So, jo Ollie, watch. Come here. So, make sure that it's full. Yeah? yeah. Go in. Yeah. Press it like that. But don't take your fingers off it. Keep it pressed until you come out. Yeah? Otherwise, you suck the sea monkeys off. Yeah? Okay. Right. Oliver's going to have a turn now. There we go, Ollie. In you go. And you do that for a minute, twice a day, guys. Like once in the night and once in the morning, really. That's it, yeah, take it out, don't let it up. That's it, go on, press that out, press that out. Yeah, let the water out, yeah, so you don't want to be sucking the sea monkeys up, do you? No. Right, go in again. No, keep your, yeah, that's it, yeah. Go in, press it, yeah, that's it, and then out again. Yeah, and you've got to do that for a minute. Go on, do it again then. That's it. You want me to do it again? Oh, you're doing it, yeah. Go on then, and again. That's it, and that just puts air in there, guys. Stops the water from going stagnant. It does stagnant. Yeah, it goes quite, the water goes bad, basically. It needs the air in there so that they can breathe. Because even though they're underwater, they need to breathe. Right, and again. Has this been five times? Uh, well, you're supposed to do it for a minute, so I'll pass it here a minute. Look, let's see if we can get some of this algae in the corner here so yeah you can go down guys and blow the algae around which uh, helps them then there we go and again there we go that's it so yeah that's what you have to do 
twice a day for a minute each time so that is how you keep your sea monkeys alive basically all right let's put the lid back on all right and we're focusing on them again it'll be a bit cloudier now guys you can't see them as well but we'll focus back in again there we go again so you can still see them guys it's a bit more murky now because obviously we've been blowing the old uh, algae around yes but they actually enjoy it when you blow the air in. It's almost like a little game to them. They, they uh, you know, they swirl around, and it's a bit like uh, fun for them. A bit like being at the fair, isn't it, Ollie? Yeah. yeah, they enjoy it. So yeah, there you go, guys. That is just an update on the sea monkeys. So earlier you probably saw them a hell of a lot clearer. Let's um, let's move it up a bit. He says so we can see different parts. Well, yeah, see that's quite murky now. You can't really see very much now. Yes. Yeah, but down the bottom it's still a bit clearer, so you can still see them there. There we go. Pull it in a bit more. There we are. That's it. That's a bit clearer. So you can see they're all down the bottom there. Swimming around like crazy. Yep. So yeah, a bit of an update, guys. Thought I'd show you. Obviously, they're going to get twice this size yet, so we'll have another update later on. But I thought that is fascinating to see. All these sea monkeys, hundreds of them. Right, and with that, guys, I'm going to say the usual. No, subscribe to all of our Nagy's world. All oh, right, yeah, and subscribe <laughs> to all of I was actually going to do it after my bits. But <laughs> Oliver's jumped in there. Yeah, if you'd like to go over to Oliver's channel, Oliver and Eggie's Mine's world, better. subscribe. It'll be linked below. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that, yeah, wrapping it up then. Uh, yeah. If you're not subscribed already, please drop me a subscribe. sub. Give me a funny thumbs up. And of course, tap the bell icon and the all icon. And join his Patreon. Oh, and join my Patreon, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, obviously, you know, if you want to get notifications, any chance whatsoever, you need to tap the old uh, notification button and the all icon. And then you might even stand a chance of getting them. Right, Going let's pull it in zoo. one more time and let you all have a little watch. Going to a zoo. There it's we the go. oldest YouTube. Video. There we go, guys, and we'll leave you watching the sea monkeys. We're going to say bye bye, Ollie. Bye bye. Bye, everybody. We'll see you again very soon. If I get 20 subs, I will make another YouTube video on my channel. Yeah, you've got an orb video to make now, haven't you? Yeah. yeah well, not right now, but today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not, not right now. Yeah. Right, guys, see you later. Bye bye.